One year ago today, I made the decision to become a paramotorist, after seeing a group of paragliders back in England. Joined by my girlfriend Cynthia, we began the most epic adventure of our lives. Since then we have met some truly amazing and kind people, who share our passion for flight. We learned the fundamentals of ground handling. We even constructed our very first Kanguk paramotor. And on November 24th, 2019, I had my first flight. We have some great adventures planned for 2020 and would like to thank all of our subscribers for their love and support. We really do appreciate you all. With that said, we welcome you to season two of Greg Anthony Harris. Kiting when it's like this is really a lesson in patience. I started out super frustrated. Just can't figure out which way the wind's going. I don't have a pole yet for my windsock, so I'm really just guessing the wind direction, and because it's so light, it's very difficult. You think it's going one way, so you launch into it, do a forward inflation, get the wing up, and suddenly you're running into a tailwind. Uh, the wing actually fell down right on top of me earlier. I was worried I was gonna get the lines all tangled and stuff, but it was okay. Just over the last couple of minutes, my frustration subsided and actually what I'm doing is just standing perfectly still and just feeling out the wind. It's something I've never really done in my entire life. This is the first time I've just stood perfectly still, very, very quietly and just felt the wind on my skin. It's such a strange thing to say but I've never done that before. Not with any real intention. Now it's coming from that direction. Now it's stopped, now it's coming from that direction. I think when you really start getting into the sport, you learn as much about yourself as you do about the sport. That way. In my limited time in this sport, which is very limited, probably got 25 minutes of flight so far. Two flights, that's it. So I have very limited experience, but the one thing I can share is you really need to have a lot of patience with this. Because right now, up at my flying field, which is half an hour away, the wind is actually 10 kilometers per hour, gusting to 35. So it's unflyable for me. And then I come to the field just down the road from my house and there's hardly any wind at all. And the wind that's there is uh, changing directions so much. And after a half an hour of frustration, I actually just find myself quite relaxed. It's very strange. Well, this is the new wing. Looks great. The riser system is incredibly simple. 
compared to what I was using before, the just the Apco lift, this is the Lift 2EZ. You can see just how bare bones this thing really is. Very simple trims. The, the trim distance is really not that far at all. That's kind of it. It really is a beginner wing. I really like it. I have the upgrade kit for it as well, so as soon as I get 30 or 40 hours in and I feel comfortable, I'll get the uh, the upgrade installed. And then it will become an intermediate wing. I'll be able to do some cross countries and uh, start throwing some crazy acro. No, not really. But for now, it's just build hours with a nice, safe, fluffy wing. I've been told it's incredibly easy to inflate. I might as well be trying to inflate the damn thing on the moon right now. Hey guys, you want to see a card trick? Like a really good one. So I'm going to make three lines of cards, and all you need to do is pick one of the cards from one of the three lines. Okay. Okay, so let's pick one of the cards, and all you need to do is tell me which line it's in. So it's either this one, this one, or this one. Okay, which line is it in this one, this one, or this one? Last time. Okay. So you have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven groups of cards. I just want you to tap on three groups. Just tap on three groups of cards. Tap, tap though, on it. Get, get that one, yeah. Uh -huh. Okay, that one, that one and that one. Yes. Okay. So I want you to tap on one group. Okay. Tap on one group. Okay. Are you sure you don't want to change your mind? Yes. Okay. So I want you to tap on one card. <laughs> Just tap on one card. Okay. Tap on one card. Are you sure you don't want to change your mind? Oh no. Yes. I'm sure. I'm sure. Okay. What was your card? The was the Jack of Hearts? The Jack of Hearts. Okay. <laughs> it's an APCO aviation bag with legs.
Yeah. <gasps> Quick. We got something. No, we're not. We're not rushing. Yeah, we're rushing. Come on. Oh, no. 